Yeah, da, 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 da. What's up, my dudes and gals? This is your boy, House Night TTT, back with another video. So, for today's video, I hope everyone is having a good day. So, first, I want to say thank you for everyone who has subbed to my channel, everyone who has liked my videos, shared the videos, um, comment my videos. I want to thank all of you very um, Thank you all of you very much for doing so as a youtuber from the bottom of my heart i want to say thank you the channels were in each and every day and i'm very happy to see that happy to see all the comments i see and everything some videos i can be harsh some videos people don't agree with my ideas and everything that i say and i understand that 100 percent but sometimes you people who watch my videos have to know you have to have some tough skin when you watch my shit. Sometimes I'm not gonna be nice. I'm gonna be a complete jackass. I'm sorry, but I just have to. I have to say the truth, cause I I don't want my generation to be full of generations of pussies who, if one person just offends them, they turn into the biggest fucking pussy there is in the whole fucking world. Like if you offend them. They would just turn to a complete pussy, get offended, start crying like a little bitch, and then make everyone else who have vagina, who has vaginas, just grow out of them. If they're a man, just make that nigga have a vagina, just support their cause of being a complete pussy. Okay, if you're a complete pussy, then uh, this channel is not for you. Unless if you want to keep seeing my content, and if you have enough thick skin to watch my content and see what I post and what I say. Alright, then go ahead. Free country. I'm not forcing you to watch my videos. I, I force no one to watch my videos. I post on the platform called YouTube.com. I can post a video right now. This video can be up for like a week and it can have like zero views and no likes, no dislikes, no shares. And I can be like, well, shit, no one watched it. Well, shit, I'll still leave on my channel then. But of all right with all that shit I'm saying, today's video is going to be on. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm doing this shit, but I still want to do it anyway. This video is going to be on transgender people. Yes, you heard me. The trannies. Yes. The trannies. And if you don't know what a transgender person is, it's basically a person who changed their gender from letting me use a famous person like Caitlyn Jenner. He turned... He was a very famous Olympic I'm so sorry for the sounds outside. These fucking planes, though. Alright, as I was saying before, before I was really interrupted. Caitlyn Jenner, who was a famous Olympic runner, and in other sports too. He was very famous and he was wealthy. He was a good man, living a good life. Everything. He had everything that he needed. This stupid motherfucker decided to change his gender, but that was his opinion. I'm not gonna go against his opinion. That was him, personally. Um, he changed his gender from male to female. So he identified the pronoun that you have to use for him is female. So you have to call him a she. But you see, I don't fuck with that transgender shit, so if I ever saw Caitlyn Jenner, or I saw a post from Caitlyn Jenner, I'll say, he, male, guy, boy, I'm not gonna use she, cause you cannot genetically change someone's gender, and be like, oh, you change the body parts of a person, and you have some hormone blockers, or whatever the fuck you wanna call them, and then you wanna be like, hey, I have a body part of a lady, and yeah, you have to, you have to use the pronouns she, girl, woman, female. No, I'm going to identify you by what you were born with. And there's some stupid laws coming out that they're going to have people with birth certificates born, and then they're going to just leave the gender part just empty, so when the person is old enough, they can just put whatever the fuck gender they want. First of all, don't do that shit. Just don't do that shit. Jump! If you watch this fucking video, do not allow no fucking state to do this. I will support you 100% if you do this shit. Do not leave a birth certificate blank for the gender part that says, Oh, when a child is old enough, he, can, he or she can pull out the fuck they want. No. Put the gender that person was born with. I do not give a fuck 
what you are. You are born, if you're a male, you're born a male. If you're born a female, you're born a fucking female. Oh my god. And I bet we're gonna get comments like, huh, you should not post a video like this. People will start hating on you. Oh, I'm gonna add sub from your channel. Ah, uh, you're speaking fucking shit. Well, if you don't like my videos, then don't watch it. Unsub and bye bye. Ciao. Fuck off. But seriously, like, what? How can you just say, huh? I feel like I should be a woman and just change your body appearance and become a female. Don't do it, please. And I've been watching this video of, um, this person named... Oh my god, why the fucking hell is my charger not charging? Yep, there we go. I'm sorry, I had to check. And that was fucking funny. My phone charger popped up. There was this girl I've been watching from TLC. TLC has some spicy shit. I don't know what the fuck I'm watching. Like, 600 pound life. Dr. Pump, um, Dr. Pimple Popper. Who else is there? This fucking I Am Jazz, the one I'm about to mention. Um, uh, my strange addiction to your TLC has some weird shit going on over there, bro. But that shit's interesting to watch though when you're bored. So I'm watching a series called I Am Jazz. I did not bought season one, two, three, four. I only snippets of it. So this girl, her name is Jazz Jennings, and when she was two years old, she asked her mother when a fairy was gonna change her from a boy to a girl because she was naturally born a boy. But she said that when is she gonna change it to a girl? And then she's currently now 17, and she had her gender. Re she transferred from boy to female at the age of is it 14? No, let me check. 14. What? No, she was 11 when they started. Um, when she, they did all this shit. I, I, Jesus Christ, statistics and shit. Yeah, she was 11. 11 when all this shit, like, changed her gender, all that. Oh my fucking gosh. As I was saying before, yes, she was 11 when they changed her gender, yada, yada, yada. When I saw that, I was like, what the fuck? How you went from PP to vagina and flat chest muscular to titties? What? Like, I don't understand. Like, she was two. Her parents let that shit slide. Like, if you see you're transgender, you're mentally ill. Your, your child is mentally ill. If your child is at the age of, when, when, how old was she when she said this shit? When she was two years old. If your child is like, Mommy, Daddy, um, I feel like I should be a boy instead of being a girl. When is a fairy going to change my gender? I will slap the shit out of my child. You do not just be like, oh, my child just say that, oh, she, f he feels like, how what fucking pronouns can I use now? He wants to be a girl. He wants to be a girl for some odd reason because he feels like it. Saying that I'm trapped in a boy's body, but I feel like I should be a girl. And they go, no, no, you have a dick for a reason. You're not a female. And then they try to bring up the God thing. They be like, oh, God wanted this to happen. No, God did not want that to happen. Because A, God is all knowing, all perfect. He never makes mistakes. So you cannot pull that God shit up. Because I don't think God is like, yeah, I didn't want this nigga to turn into a female, so don't bring my name into this. Thank you very much. And then, like, the videos I see from her is, like, kind of interesting. Like, why? Like, why would her parents even allow some shit like this to happen in the first place? Like, you all this... Why you allow your child to change genders? And then there was another one with, um, two runners from the UK. They were they trans they they were boys at first and then they went with the girls. This is so disgusting. And then they're runners, they're track runners. And then the news and everyone else is saying that this is unfair. They should be running for boys. I get it. And then people are like backing up, with like no, they're girls. Yada the other, yada. They change gender. No motherfucker. If you're born as a boy, you're a fucking boy. You can change. You can you can turn your dick 
out inside out and become a and make a vagina and grow some titties with some hormones and pills but inside genetically you are a fucking male you have a pee pee you are not a female i will use the pronouns he male boy and whatever the fuck other pronouns there is of boys you're not a fucking female so they're saying that they should be running for the um boys um tracks Checking, they should be running in for boys, not girls. Because, first of all, you're born as boys. Second of all, even if they use all those hormone shits, the genetics as a male, males are genetically faster and stronger than females. And I know I'm gonna get some social justice warrior, some fucking feminist who's gonna be like, oh, you being sexist. No, it's not sexist. Males are genetically stronger and faster than females. You can find out. Anywhere on the fucking internet, fucking studies and fucking s p professors and scientists have proved this shit a l for a long fucking time. So I don't want to hear no shit. Because if I was supposed to fight a female right now, I would 100% win. Unless this bitch is like 600 pounds and attempts to sit on me, then I'm fucked. Unless I can lift her up with some magical powers, then you you won't win. Unless you're some fucking UFC motherfucker. But you take steroids, then that's disgusting, and I won't fight you because if I pop, if I punch your titty, I know that shit's gonna pop. As I was saying before from the video, no, no, it's a mentally ill condition. If your child says that you want to change gender, your child's mentally ill at that age. You cannot just agree with your child and be like, okay, let's just change the gender when it's appropriate time or age they can do it. No, it's fucking disgusting. It's fucking not right, and you have to allow your child to grow up a bit more think, huh, do I really want to change my gender from male to female or female to male? Do I? And then all the shit she goes through and all that. And then she has like some three other friends. Some nigga who looks like a fucking boy but has the bottom surgery already and has the body parts of a female but the face of a nigger even though he has long hair and then another friend of theirs that's full-blown a bloke it, it, it 100% looks like a boy because his parents are too freaking religious and they don't want him to convert from a boy to girl I don't understand that 100% like why would you really want to do that to yourself then they have this third friend that has braces I thought that was a I thought that was a girl. I thought that wasn't a transgender. I saw her. I'm like, yo, that's a real girl they're talking to. I'm like in my mind, I was like, yo, I don't know fuck. And then she pulls out I'm a transgender. I was like, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is this that's fucking disgusting. Oh my god, I was so disappointed. I, I said that, I showed my friends, I was like, yo, I wanna fuck this. And they're like, yo, bro, that looks mad nice. I'm like, yo, that's a nigga, bro. They're like, what? That's a transgender. They're like, yo, oh my god, bro. That nigga had a wee wee at one point. Nigga was one more wee wee. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I was surprised. I was surprised as fuck, bro. Shit, I was surprised as fuck. As I was saying before, I was surprised. That shit not cool though. That's a fucking chat. If you if you know anime shit, bros, if you niggas who watch anime know what trap is, you know what trap is, bro. Them transgender niggas who looking mad fine as a bitch, that's a trap. When they say after you finish fucking them that they were a nigga at one point, hmm, hmm. Oh my god. Oh my god, you used to have a weebie, now you have a china. Oh my god. So yeah, it's just a mentally ill condition. Caitlyn Jenner and everyone else, they're adults, so they have they make their own life choices. 
They know that doing this can affect them and their family, or if there's families on watch this planet I'm born with them, then hey, that's them, not me. But still, that's still fucking disgusting as well. Like, I, no matter who you are, or if you change your gender, you can't change your gender. It's like saying, hey, you just take out the genetics of being a male and just put females to genetics. No. Even if you put the hormones as females, you're still male. You still have a male brain. You still have male genetics. Well, you do kind of still have male parts, but it's converted to female parts. Kind of. So I get that like 50 50. But yeah, still. Don't say you're transgender. That's disgusting. Like, you're mentally ill. And then I know there's gonna be some fucking people with their vaginas sticking out saying, Oh, this is so offensive. Huh, you should not be posting shit like this. People will get offended. Well, this is the real world. This is not no place full of lollipops, candies, and everyone is in peace with each other. Niggas will go with war all the time. I really want a world a world that has peace, everyone loves each other. This is the, all the fighting, but it never happens. But we never know in the future might happen. And people have to go take skin on the internet. Like, this is the internet. The internet is full of a lot of fucked up people. I met some, and I'm used to their fuckery, so I really don't give a fuck what they say. But some people, they will just break down immediately. Me, I have thick skin, or maybe because I'm just a male, and I, I don't really show emotions that much. Because I really don't want people to think I'm a bitch. Because it's called masculinity. It's called not showing you're a bitch. It's called showing that you're a man. You can hold your emotions down and still have a strict face of saying, I will not let nothing make me feel sad or a bitch. Ah, but yeah, transgender, that's that's a fucking mentally, that's a, that's a disease. That's a mental disease. If your child ever says they want to become... From a boy to a female, a female to a boy, slap the shit out of your child and say, "Don't pull that shit again." And yeah, this has been a vid this has been the end of the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Also, let me say something. Let me say something real quick. That Jazz Jen Jennings has a YouTube channel. She posted a video. The thumbnail was a trap. I knew it was a trap. I clicked on it. It was a good trap. But, it was a nigga though. It was called My Boobs. Were they real or fake? They were fake because first of all, she had to take pills and hormones for it. So, it's not really natural because the pills actually support you. So yeah, that's one. Two, your titties. Fine ass titties. I think they were like 34 Double D's. When I saw them, my mouth, my head said "fuck." No, no, my mind, my brain said, "That's a nigga." My dick said, "I want the fuck." My brain. I let that one rock for today. I went with my brain, not my dick, because that was a nigga. That was a nigga. I cannot one day go on a date and then. And then I smash, and then afterwards, they tell me I was a transgender. I used to be a nigga. Imagine that. Imagine you just smash the one, and then afterwards, they're like, oh, that was the best sex I ever had. Oh, I had to tell you something. I was a transgender. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. You used to have a wee wee? Ah, Jesus almighty. I have fucked a man or. Oh. I fucked a man or oh, Jesus Imagine telling your parents you fucked a transgender Oh my god you you become you become a embarrassment for your family Your family will disown you They will say ah you like fucking men now Ah Jesus Christ Oh my lordy Jesus Oh Lord help me please oh please Please Jesus if that shit ever happens to one of my niggas, I will feel so sorry for them. Oh my gosh. You fucked a man. That was a trap. Oh. That was a trap. But hey. 
let me just finish this video before I say some more ridiculous shit. I hope you all enjoyed this video and got some points for this video. I'm not bashing transgender people and everything. I'm just saying that you can't just let a two-year-old just say, Hey, I don't feel like being a boy. Can I become a girl? Because I feel like it. Let that child grow up more to just realize, do I really want to do it? And then if they go with it, then maybe that's them. But still, it's kind of fucked up though. And don't bring God into this because don't bring God. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And you'll share this all with your family and friends who will like a video like this to watch. And yeah. This has been your boy Hustle and TTT. I hope you liked the video, disliked the video, why you disliked the video. And tell me how I can improve as a YouTuber and improve on my YouTube videos. And I will catch all my hoggers and doggers later. P-E-A-C-E -E sounds, spells, peace. This is Mel performance, okay? This is masculinity, not that pussy shit, I right? That male shit. Yeah. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And P-E-A-C -E sounds, spells, peace. I love all you guys and girls and peace. Last time, TTT Army is going to start here each and every day.